For almost a decade, Owlboy has lurked behind the curtain of mainstream releases with a small but devout following, inspired by little more than its retro aesthetic. What the screenshots and teaser videos early on didn't show was the humor, the heartfelt personalities, and the disasters that befall their otherwise bright and uplifting world. Owlboy had the makings of a modern classic all along, but it's not until you break through the surface that you're blinded by its artistic brilliance. It begins with Otis, our mute protagonist, and the village runt, during a stressful dream where his professor and dark figments criticize his inadequacies. It's a powerful setup that endears our hero, but in short order, concerns of a nearby pirate sighting explodes into a full-on emergency as Otis's village and a nearby metropolis come under a full-blown assault. With no one to hold him back, Otis teams up with a military mechanic, Getty, to fight back. Those quick to label Owlboy as another in a long line of pixelated games aren't technically wrong, but where many retro titles aim to ape 8 or 16-bit graphics, Owlboy does its own thing. It doesn't have a limited color palette, and its pixel resolution changes based on the scene at hand. From subterranean creatures to ancient structures, Owlboy's art tackles multiple themes and subjects with consistently impressive execution. Owlboy is still old school, but not just in its presentation, also in its storytelling. There's no voice acting, and events are set in stone with nary a major decision-making opportunity in sight. The plot manages to avoid predictability not only through a handful of twists, but by allowing characters to evolve throughout the course of the game. Sad moments aren't swept under the rug by unreasonably optimistic outlooks and positivity. They stay with your squad, and fundamentally alter their outlook on the mission and their own identity in surprising ways. When you first take control of Otis in the real world, darting around floating islands and chatting with other anthropomorphized creatures makes for a pleasant experience. And while the open air and bright colors deserve some credit, it's the orchestrated soundtrack that solidifies Owlboy's shifting atmosphere and tone. Violas and flutes instill merriment at first, but this innocence is short-lived. When invading pirates set to dismantle the society by taking control of powerful relics, oboes drone, and cellos growl to the slow beat of a heavy drum. When the dust settles and the second half of your journey kicks off, sprightly piano compositions provide a much-needed respite from the stress of a society under attack. Your trek to the pirate's den takes you through expansive spaces and into the heart of sprawling cave systems where buccaneers and wildlife alike lie in wait. Otis can only dash into enemies, stunning them at best. However, with the help of a handy teleportation device, he can summon one of his three partners into his claws mid-flight to utilize their long-range blaster, shotgun, or webbing that can ensnare enemies and be used as a grappling hook to escape dangerous situations. Otis is unfortunately a tad slow by default, which causes you to spam his dash move repeatedly to keep things moving outside of combat. There is a modest equipment upgrade system driven by collecting and turning in coins you find in chests, but a keen eye and fast reflexes are more critical to success than any upgrades purchased during your adventure. Knowing that victory came from a show of skill rather than your ability to collect upgrades is gratifying, but you do walk away from the game with the sinking feeling that its upgrade system has unrealized potential. With deaf pacing, Owlboy steadily mixes combat and exploration with measured stealth challenges, fast-paced escape sequences, and entertaining exchanges between characters. The chase and escape sequences in particular are some of the most impressive moments in the game, throwing you into a harrowing race against time in the face of tightly choreographed hazards. These scenes are challenging and filled with visual effects that add to the sense of danger, and they can be overwhelming at first. But should you die, not to worry. Owlboy never truly punishes you for failure, allowing you to restart immediately from the last room you enter. Owlboy is consistently charming and surprising, and while its final act raises the bar on every front, it's bittersweet when it comes to a close. As you relish the outcome of the final battle, you can't help but reflect on the beginning of your adventure, and how far the world and its players have come. You'll never be able to play Owlboy for the first time again, but the memories of its magic moments stick with you. This is more than a treat for fans of old school games. Owlboy is a heartfelt experience that will touch anyone with an affinity for great art and storytelling.